everyone. In this lecture, we will learn about angle constraint tool. We can find this tool on the constraints toolbar here. This tool creates an angle between two selected surfaces or planes. Let's understand this through an example. Before applying angle constraint, let's fix arm 1. Let's apply coincidence and surface constraint between arm 1 and arm 2. Now click on angle constraint tool. Select the planes like this. Constraint properties window opens up. We can select the sector from the sector tab. On the angle tab, let's enter 50 degrees and click OK. Click on update tool. We can see that product is updated with the angle constraint. Double click on the angle constraint from specification tree. Let's enter the value as 90 degrees. We can see that product is updated with the angle constraint. 